everybody, this is Charles for Premier Guitar. I'm with Sam from Cardinal Instruments, and we're with Sam Stuff. What do you got here, man? I brought three guitars to the LA Amp Show this year. Um, from left to right, we brought a Copper Top Magpie. That's our latest model with the Lawler Supro lap steel pickup. The trapeze tailpiece. Uh, it's a sinker cypress body, solid. The veneer on top is patinaed uh, using heat and various chemical processes. Each one is unique. Uh, the neck is rosewood. Um, the fretboard is cocobolo. That is probably what most consider to be our slide guitar, but uh, quite frankly, I think it's good for just about anything. I don't play it uh, for slide. I play the one in the shop as a fretted instrument just because I like to pick up so much. So, And then the next one we have is the Zenith. Uh, that's kind of um, an upscale version. We went with a book match Sapelle top. Uh, the back is one piece, Honduran mahogany. It's chambered. Uh, the chrome hardware uh, pickup covers and knobs seem to work really well with that. That's a varnish on top and the back on the body. The neck is Palferro along with the fretboard. Uh, the pickups were hand wound by me um, that are specifically wound for that particular guitar. I string the guitars up first before I wind the pickup. So. And then I have some unique little tricks that I like to use to make it work that much better with each guitar. Yeah, when you say you're doing that, you're stringing up the guitar first and getting a feel for how it yep. resonates, how it feels, and then you're going to make your do your wind. Absolutely. That's absolutely correct. Because you get to, you think you know what the guitar is going to sound like before you string it up, but there's, it doesn't always wind up that way. Yeah, that's a cool approach. Okay, so what's this one uh, furthest here on the left? The last or the one right? we have is the West model. Um, it... That's our demonstrator. We ship that around uh, the country for folks to check out, and as they're done with it, they ship it on to the next person. Uh, the west is chambered. Uh, the body is mesquite in the back. The top is walnut, as is the neck, and the fretboard is Texas ebony. The pickups are our design, our custom design, made in-house, wound in-house. Uh, again, wound specifically for that guitar. Uh, this one really stands out mostly because Every piece of wood you see was procured within about a 20-mile radius of my shop in Austin, Texas. I was going to say mesquite and Texas mahogany. I mean, that's pretty Texas it is guitar. Texas as it gets, and when they catch on fire, they smell really good. Yeah. Don't throw this one on the barbecue, please, folks. Yeah, please don't. Please don't. The uh, We made the first two, the Magpie and the Zenith, specifically for the show. Uh, the demonstrator we wanted to bring in case somebody felt like they just had to have it for a week yeah. and it's due for a West Coast tour. Gotcha. And we thought, well, we'll bring it. it it's held together beautifully. Uh, I want to say it's been in the hands of at least a dozen people. So uh, I was pretty impressed when I got it back. It wasn't, wasn't a whole heck of a lot of work to get it up to speed for the show. A lot of the stability of the thing. I think so. It's uh, from double acting truss rods to really old, stable pieces of wood. These really are built one at a time. I have no desire to, you know, to build widgets, so to speak. That's what wood's going to work. If it doesn't work, we don't use it. So minimize our tropical wood content on the models, and we're pretty happy where we are. Cool, man. So uh, where should we send folks uh, if they want to find out more about your uh, guitars and your techniques and what you're up to and how they can get them? Great. Uh, best way to get in touch with me is uh, info at cardinalinstruments.com. That's plural. And there's a link to our Facebook page there, too, where we update the Facebook page. I do almost daily, much to the chagrin of the people that have liked me on Facebook. But... Uh, it's just easier to do. The website has the high res pictures and uh, specs and details and contact information. So it's kind of the best of both worlds, in my opinion. Lots to look at. And if you're lucky, lots to hear. So uh, thanks a lot, Sam. It was a pleasure. Good to meet you. Thank you. Get back to Texas safe. I will do. It's, uh, well, it's a long flight, let's say that. I'm not sure. All right, then. This is Charles for PremierGuitar.com.